Xerox lair. So we actually found his fortress inside the fortress. Oh, look at the little smiley face on the train. Isn't that cute? Hmm. Well, I think I kind of liked this boss battle. Oh, never mind. We never thought you'd get this far. Your final encounter with Zarak awaits beyond this point. He has surrounded himself with his unnatural bodyguards, but you may yet even the odds by calling upon the lost souls collected within your chalice. Place the chalice on the shield at the heart of the arena. Good luck, Sir Daniel Fortescue. Hmm, so I guess the chalice is useful beyond the, web, uh, the the various upgrades we get after all. Okay, let's see here. What do we need for the for the last battle? <laughs> I could probably just buy everything, but I'll get this stuff and this stuff and this. Yeah, okay, let, let's just get it all, even though we are not going to use it. Okay, uh, as I was saying, the uh, the first part of the boss battle is actually kind of interesting because we don't really fight. We help minions fight for us. And how does this work? Well, you're going to see shortly. So we simply go to the seal in the middle and call upon the lost souls. Automatically. So my old nemesis, so we meet again. I see that a century spent as worm food has done nothing to diminish your naive obsession with the freedom of Galomir. I want the dogs gnawing marrow from those bones within the hour. Ah! What is that, Fortescue? Your lucky cup? So all these freed souls are now fighting for us. In fact, we cannot even defeat the soldiers ourselves. However, what we can do is heal these guys with our own health. Oh no. Already things are looking grim. Uh, so basically we sacrifice our own life energy to keep them fighting. And yeah, just have to run around and, and check the color of the skeletons. If they are green, everything's okay. If they are yellow, they are already pretty damaged. But if they are red, they are in real trouble. Basically, I just run around and heal whatever's around because we can't afford to lose too many of them. I already lost one of them. Whoa, this guy nearly died. So, our guys are a lot weaker than Xerox troops. But because I heal them with my own health, uh, they get the staying power they need to d defeat Xerox troops against the odds. Ah, one of, one of Xerox guys just died, that's why two of my guys are now fighting one of his. This guy really needs help. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I can preserve more of my health, but I don't know. Okay. Well, fight. 
help your buddies. Don't just stand there. Dude, why don't you help them? Yeah, finally. Okay, so basically six versus two, I guess. Take a match now. Just preserve the rest of my life. Come on! Perfect. And this guy. Hurry up already. See, I, I can't even attack them. And that's it. Hooray! So now they can find their eternal rest, finally. And at least they leave behind some health, so I can replenish myself a bit. Before the actual boss fight. Woo! 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 You get the idea. Okay. Well, I'm gonna pause here and we'll continue with the actual boss fight right after this. Bye guys!